Hey guys, how are you? It's Michelle Ray with glasses on. Today my eyes were so dry. This morning I could not shove my contacts back in my eyes. So apologies for the reflections, but hey guys, how are you? Welcome back to my attic. I'm Michelle Ray. I am a thrifter, a mom, an actress, a model. I am a breast cancer survivor. I am an outdoorsy girl. And I, like I said, I'm a thrifter. I love finding great bargains, reselling them. I do it part-time, specifically right now on Poshmark and I'm just learning. I haven't been doing it yet for a year, but I absolutely love it. And I'm so excited that you guys joined me today uh, because something happened to me this week that was really annoying. And it's something that's really important that I think you guys should contemplate to think about. Okay, so here's what happened. Um, I'm sorry about my squeaky chair. <laughs> so here's what happened. I posted a pair of jeans, a pair of true religion jeans, and they are in great condition, except at the bottom of the jeans, there was some wear. So I always do as best the best I can on taking, you know, either videos or photos and pictures, and I make sure I cover all my angles. So I posted that there was some wear on them, and I put in the description that, you know, there was some wear, please see the picture. Anyway, sent it out. I was happy, whatever, blah, blah, blah. All of a sudden I get this message in my email and it's like, so-and-so gave you a rating. And then I was like, <laughs> nah, cause you know, you get that little, that little mail thing that says, oh, somebody gave you a five star. I don't know. You kind of know like that you're getting the, the, the good one. So I went and I got a three out of five stars. Now I'm not perfect. I absolutely try my hardest, um, but no, I'm not by any means perfect. But I really felt strongly that this wasn't okay. So I looked at the comment and the comment said, could have been better. Um, the jeans looked a little bit more worn than I thought the picture was and they feel a little bit thin. Okay, it's just a matter of opinion. That's what it is. And so that's why the situation was so frustrating to me and, and it made me really think about things, okay? Do I wanna post things that are 100% perfect? No, I don't. I don't want to do that because I'm afraid now that it's a matter of someone else just saying, Oh, you know what? I don't really think it looked, it looked more worn than you said. So I went to Poshmark because, you know, I'm still learning guys. And I thought, well, I'm just gonna write them and say, wait a minute, let me show you these pictures. Like, you know, and I couldn't get in touch with them because I guess that's their policy. Or you really can't dispute what someone says when they leave you a review. And that's really frustrating. And that's, I don't know. Can you please put in the comments below? Is that how it works with like Mercari or um, The Real Real or even eBay? Can you guys put in the comments? I like to learn. I, I would like to learn about other platforms, but I'm really taking uh, Poshmark slowly because there are so many different layers to it. I just, I'm trying to get a grip. <laughs> I mean, I've been trying to get a grip for a long time, but that's like a whole nother YouTube channel show. Anyway, that's the question up for you guys to think about as new resellers or thrifters or doing whatever you're doing when you're reselling your product. Is it worth um, taking that chance? Is it worth it? A matter of, of, of opinion. So I think this week I've learned my lesson and I'm not going to, play, to, to put anything up that has any like holes or anything. I'd see like, for instance, this is this really cute G, J. Crew uh, sweatshirt and I was just looking at it and you know, it's got like a couple of little spots here that could probably be tacked really easily and sewn up really easily, but I'm afraid, I'm afraid to post it because I don't want, you know, somebody to complain about it or see something differently. So anyways, guys, please put in the comments if you have any suggestions or if there's ways to speak to Pop, Poshmark or whatever, I would love to hear from you. And if you like this content and if you think I'm giving you helpful, helpful information, please go ahead and like and subscribe and make me the happy happiest girl with the shiniest glasses in the whole world. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining guys. I'm always so thankful and grateful and I can't wait to see you next time. Of course, peace out.